Hello, the Windows Nerd here. Um, I have been busy testing hard drives uh, the last uh, two or three hours. And this is what I got. I have a lot more, like maybe three, four or five hundred more hard drives. Boxes full of it. Uh, these are the ones that are wiped, that are working, no bad sectors and stuff. I threw it away already, like 20 hard drives with one or two bad sectors on them. Uh, relocated sectors, all that kind of stuff. I don't want those hard drives, they're old, so I just threw them away. I have enough of those drives. I actually re recycle them, I uh, keep the magnets. Here we have another one, oh, that's 40 gig. That's what we can also. I came out of a Dell Optiplex GX280. Uh, These are all smaller than uh, 10 gigs. This one is like, I, I will just so show them. This one is 8.4 gigs. This one is 2 gigs. It's a very nice one. It's from um, like 97 or 96. I've got a 1 gig model. Uh, in an old Packer Bell, I made a video of that. It still doesn't work. I maybe can fix that one. This is 4.3 gigs. This is a really small one for its age. It isn't so big as the other hard drives. It's one gig. 1080 megabytes. Which year is it? Uh, maybe on the back. Yeah, it's from 1997. This one is. Uh, I only have one of this this hard drive, GTS hard drive. I never saw that before. It's uh, 3.2 gigs. Pretty much suck, but nice to have in to have it in my collection. Um, okay, over here, one of four three gigs that came out of the compact with I'm using with Windows 98. I made a video of that. Um, this is a Western Digital Caviar uh, two gigs hard drive. I really like that one. All right. So these are all the smaller than 10 gigs. This is a Bigfoot hard drive, a quantum uh, 6.3 gig hard drive that came out of a, um, uh, a compact with a dead motherboard. I just uh, scrapped the, the compact computer and uh, saved the hard drive and the RAM and the CPU, it was a penny of free. Over here we have all the Western Digital 6.4 gigs. Yes, 6.4 gig hard drives. These are all uh, 10 gig hard drives. Some of them are 10.5. These are all uh, 40 gig and 30 gig. And these are all 20 gig. I have a lot more of the 20 gig hard drives, but I need to test them. <sighs> what can I else show? Mm, not really much. This uh, HP. Uh, computer in a failed case mod. The camera shows it a little older but in my eyes it looks really orange. Uh, it is working actually I think. It has 4 gigs of RAM. It had um, an 8500 dual core CPU in it. Maybe I'm gonna fix it. Maybe I'm gonna just scrap the motherboard and keep the RAM. But is it really worth it? Um, yeah, I've laying around a lot of computer parts in my house. Here is a monitor. Here is another computer. Some DVD drives, some PlayStations. I'm actually at the attic where I keep all my computer parts. It's a mess in here. Over there you see the Packard Bell. I really want to fix that. It's a mess in here, I need to clean it up sometime. Yeah, downstairs I also have 
um, more computer parts that are actually for sale. I, I said that before, like 80 gig hard drives, 160 gig hard drives, 250 gig hard drives. And uh, the SSDs are not for sale, I want to keep them myself. Also, if you want to have some of these hard drives, I have a lot more of them. Uh, if you want to have some of these, just send me a message or leave a comment. If you live in the Netherlands, you only give me f like 10 euros for one hard drive, in including shipping. I have so many of these. So, I don't care about the money, only the shipping costs you need to pay yourself. I don't want to lose money. So, um, so you know, for right now, if you want to know something of me or get my Skype or something, just send me a message, it will be nice. Alright, uh, this was Windows 9 for this time, thank you for watching.